Hi, I'm Dr. Stephen Bennett. I'm an optometrist in Ann Arbor, Michigan. I have two private offices and uh, four associates. And I want to talk about things that I've learned over the last 30 some years. One of the things that I like most about optometry is that you can work with patients and really affect the change. And one of the things I've found over the years is the questions that you ask are almost as important as the exam procedures that you perform. Questions that are important that patients have to have an answer for and that are open-ended so that we can start a communication. So one of the best questions that I found that has helped build my contact lens practice is not asking the patients are they interested in contacts, but asking them if they've ever thought about contacts. Because when you're sitting in the room and you ask the patient or you have it on the chart, you know, have you ever, are you, are you interested in contacts? Well, they say no, and then you have nowhere to go with that. But if you ask a patient, have you ever thought about contacts, they actually pause and answer. They say things like, well, you know, I did, but, you know, they're, they're kind of a hassle, or I used to wear them, and all this information comes up, and then you have a wonderful opportunity to talk about all the new lenses that are available, especially the daily disposable lenses that really can help patients who have been previous wearers and have previous dropouts. So by asking that question, I usually will fit, we did sort of a study in our office, by asking that question, we have four associates, we fit at least one new patient a day who came in for glasses, but ended up getting contact lenses, full fees, and they got glasses. So that, that question really helps. Another question that we ask to find what we call the silent sufferers, patients that really are having some trouble with contacts but think that it's fine, think that contact lenses maybe are supposed to be dry at night. Uh, it's just what they've always learned. So what I do is when I'm in the slit lamp, I'm talking to the patient, I say, because I'm telling them what we're doing, and then I ask, listen, when you finally replace your lenses, does the new pair feel better than the old pair? And inevitably they say, oh, absolutely. And then I take the slit lamp away and I say, they're not supposed to. And what's happening is that you are limiting the oxygen to your eye. And I would like to talk to you about perhaps a better lens that might improve the oxygen transmissibility and eliminate some of the dryness issues that you've been having. And so that particular question really gains a lot of information and again allows us to help patients where they think that dryness and irritation can be part and parcel of just wearing contact lenses. And that, that, that's a fun question because it really, it really gets into a lot of discussions. Um, one of the questions that we never ask and we train our staff to never ask is how many boxes do you want? Our practice is uh, very successful in fitting year supply lenses and, and having patients get year supplies. And we do that by assuming that patients will get a year supply. And we always talk in terms of year supply. Most patients think that it might be a little more expensive, but they're really worried that their prescription will change. So one of the things that we do when we talk about that we either have their supply here or direct ship their supply to them, is that they get warranties in our office. One of the warranties is their lost and damaged lenses are given back to them at no charge. And if their prescription changes during the year, which is a major concern, we exchange their boxes, opened or unopened, at no charge. And that very rarely, if ever, happens. And then at the end of the year, we will give them lenses to get by if they've scheduled an appointment. So these types of questions are things that we've been working on over the years and it allows us to communicate and educate uh, our patients, establish a rapport so they feel that when they left the office they've gotten more knowledge about their eyes and about contact lenses than they've gotten elsewhere. And that's the wow factor. We want our patients to leave wowed, not just satisfied, but wowed. Thank you for listening. Good night.